So uh, this is a flyer that's out on uh, the table across from where you registered. Um, it's about the uh, Upstate Carolina Linux Users Group. Upstate Carolina Linux Users Group is also called UC Lug or UC Lug. So you may hear me say either one of those. That barcode that's on that table refers to this Google Doc. So if you want to go click the links instead of having to type them in, um, you're welcome to do that here. Um, so, uh, oh shoot, let's go over here. Don't rush too much. There we go. No, I've got five minutes. So, um, oh, uh, so Porter, one of the, as Jim had mentioned, one of the reasons to have uh, uh, Hack Greenville Nights is uh, to meet other people and, and meet other groups and other uh, events. So go over to the table, get the stickers, get the flyers, get the business cards. Um, there's a whiteboard that if people forgot their group, or if you have a group that we didn't know about, or if you want to start a group and say, hey, maybe would anyone be interested, please write on the, on the whiteboard of, of what you might be interested in. So put yours up there. Um, <clears throat> As you might imagine, uh, UC Lug, uh, the focus of our group is Linux and uh, Floss, free libre open source software. So you'll see here there's a, uh, like a list of sort of things that's obviously off on topic, but we've also had over the past couple of years a little stuff that's off topic. Uh, we've had a talk about uh, NASA's Apollo computers. We've talked about a member who uh, built a tiny home by himself from scratch with the exception of the slab. Everything else he built himself. It was amazing. Uh, last year we had a talk about hacking satellites and making a CubeSat network you know, by yourself. Uh, so it was really uh, cool. Um, well, this month, you just walked out. Barry, you just walked out. <laughs> this month, uh, Barry gave a talk on starting with Linux. If you're new to Linux um, or you're just starting out, it's, it was a really great talk. He, he talked right here um, uh, in that room right next door. And we have all of our... Um, uh, discussions uh, uh, on YouTube going to about two, 2010 or so. Um, and that, this is where I click up here and show you. If you do a search on YouTube for UC Lug or Uplug, go to the playlist. You can go by year and you'll see uh, right here is uh, the talk I was talking about, uh, starting with Linux. That's Barry's talk. Um, so. He's back. And now he's back. Okay. Um, so uh, Uplug is a is an open source group. We have no group dues. There's no membership. There's no roll call. Um, it, it, someone mentioned to me one time that it's more of a meritocracy. If you want something done, you do it. I'm the guy that wants to have talks, so I'm the one that gets that arranged. Um, we meet every Tuesday of every month at uh, 6:30 right over here in the Open Works. We have met every second Tuesday of the month um, since 1998 when I uh, joined. Uh, we also uh, have a, on a video call uh, on Jitsi, which is a free service that's kind of like Zoom. Um, and uh, we co-meet we co with uh, COLA Lug, the Colonial Linux users group, and together we form South Carolina Lugs. Um, you're welcome to join the, the Jitsi if you can't make it in person here or in Columbia. <clears throat> I like to announce the topics a week ahead of time and a day ahead of time, so if you uh, look on our mail, you can join our mailing list, which, which is a Google group. I use it as a mailing list, but some people use it as a form. I also uh, announced on the Get Together, which is uh, a website that's kind of like Meetup. Um, Hack Greenville's Meetup is kind enough to allow me to rebroadcast. So occasionally I will, especially like the, the CubeSat, I reannounce on Hack Greenville. So if you want to join any of those sorts of things, um, or I also announce in the Slack, uh, the Hack Greenville Slack in the Panel Linux group and the Panel Events group. Um, and occasionally, if it's uh, on topic for something else, so like the, the CubeSat. Uh, was kind of a hacker, or it's also a security kind of talk, it's also kind of a, a uh, makerspace talk, so I, I also announced those groups. I try not to spam those groups if necessary. And I'm always in look for, uh, I'm always in need for speakers and topics if you want to know about something, so uh, please uh, uh, get in touch with me here somehow and uh, we'd love to have you. Alright, so one of the ones we talked about last year, one of the speech, one of the talks that I gave last year was on bash history. So um, let me tell you about that, and that is by doing this key combination. So you may uh, know that Bash is the default uh, shell in most Linux distributions, and uh, you've probably done uh, used history by going up and using up and down arrow keys, like I'm doing right here. Okay. Y'all can't see that, though, can you? Okay, so here it is. Uh, if you type the word history, though, it'll show you what your history is and what you've done for the past whatever. You can use this knowledge to say, okay, I want to redo, I want to rerun the ping here, which is uh, 1056 toward the end. Here. Yeah, there's the corner. Uh, so I can do a, a pound ping, and it'll rerun that. So that's from your control C. 
Um, I, what if you want to do, uh, actually do that by number? I can do a bang one of five six, and that'll run the ping command again. Um, if I want to do uh, uh, at the top of the screen ten sixty is vi uc log intro nights. I'm going to do ten, bang ten sixty, and that'll rerun the command if I type it correctly, which I didn't do. And there it is, and that's my time. So thank you. <laughs>